are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. My name is uh, Sister Evangelist Verna Montgomery. It's nice to meet you, you Sister Evangelist. You too. Look at you. So smiling this morning. Uh, strong in your spirit. Strong arms and everything. Did anybody tell you that you could be Jesus of Nazareth? <laughs> uh, actually, that's the first time I heard really? it. Really? Yeah. You should play that. I don't know, I have terrible stage fright. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Listen, I'm here because I need to look at a brochure that explain what you do here at this church. Because see, in my old church, I was good and involved, honey. I was okay. involved. Let me tell you what I did. I was the church orator, and then I uh, sold all the wings on the church costumes for the pageants. Okay. Ooh, I did that. So what do you do here that I can do? Okay, mm -hmm. well, you're in luck. I oh, think you've right. come to the right spot, okay? okay this is a book. It's the FCC Involvement Book, and in it, it entails over 300 ministries 300? and opportunities that you can get involved. 300? Yes. We have the choir, we have the youth choir, okay. we have the children's choir, we have the dance ministry, we have the cafe, the concessions, the lobby, the hostess, the ushers, the greeters, the servants, the ambassadors. You can also get involved behind the scenes in our production in, in props, in lights, in sound, in camera. Uh, you mentioned something about sewing. We have a costume department. For Jesus Nazareth, we have a cast of about a thousand people, so that's plenty of costumes that need sewing. We also have animals involved so we need some people to clean up the fecal young matter. Is man, that gonna be a young concern? man, young man. Ooh, that's a lot. Can I overwhelm you, Sister Evangelist Verna Montgomery? I feel a little overwhelmed in my spirit. Okay. I do. Well okay. Maybe it'll be best if I just showed you around. Right. Let's sure. do All that. Right. I on. like to walk. That'll help me out. Ooh. You dress so sharp. Who taught you how to dress like that? I got it from my mom. Yes, I did. And that hat. Tell me about that hat. You don't want to know about this hat. I got this hat for 50 cents. <laughs> I can get you one of these hats if you want to. Oh, I think you wear it better than I do. Oh, ain't you just sweet? <laughs> I resurrected my pastor's wife's fashion. She was y'all. Okay. Oh, these chairs are comfortable. Are we in an AMC 16? <laughs> What earth is that? Now, I heard you when you said that you do all kinds of productions and things like that. Now, I done been to Vegas now, mm -hmm. okay? I done seen them Cirque du Soleil shows, but what I want to know, are you doing this for Christ? Is anyone getting saved? Absolutely. I'm so glad you asked, Miss mm -hmm. Montgomery. Mm -hmm. Every production that we do, we do to lift up the cross and lift up the name of Jesus. And many people find salvation in this house. Hey, many people. Let me show you what I mean. Okay. Ooh.
Yes, yes. I have a gentleman on line one regarding Jesus of Nazareth ticket sales. Mm -hmm. He would like to know if the camel ride is included in the price of the ticket. Oh. Okay, thank you, Kathy. You're welcome. Ms. Montgomery, would you mind while I take this phone call? Yeah, go <coughs> Hi, Pastor Terry. This is the seventh time you've called. How many times do I have to tell you that you have to be at least five, six to ride the camel? No. No, you cannot sit on Pastor John Ponder's shoulders. Absolutely not. Pastor Terry, I'm really busy at the ticket booth right now. I'm going to have to deal with this later, okay? Thank you. Thank you, Miss Montgomery. Oh, you're welcome, baby. Those numbers blessed my soul. 